Oh, good morning, guys. I didn't even know I was there. Welcome to Dogs Are Us. And I want to show you guys how to cook a sudden quick breakfast for you and your beagle. Now, keep in mind, Mr. Beagle's probably somewhere on the chair, somewhere asleep, because he usually don't get up around 7.30. So, it's a snow day. It's cold here. It's like 23 degrees. I was like, well, I did cook breakfast, I mean, uh, dinner last night on uh, Carolina Diamonds Productions, but I'm going to cook a good breakfast on Dogs Are Us, because I am the owner of Mr. Beagle. But you want to know where Mr. Beagle is, guys? Y'all miss him. Here he come. But I'm gonna get. I'm gonna let you guys spend like five minutes with him while I go wash my face and get in this kitchen, burn some quick breakfast because we hungry around here. Hey, I'm Mr. Big Gal. We double stream. I'm double streaming on a uh, Carolina Diamond, and I'm also double streaming on uh, Dogs R Us. So we're just trying to get this channel going up for Mr. Beagle. Mr. Beagle so much, and so he go. He's just laying around sleeping, y'all. I'm gonna give y'all a little bit of him all day today. Then we're gonna cook this breakfast about. About 7.15. Mr. Biggie, your people wants to see you, boy. Here you go. Dogs are us on you. Ronnie got Carolina Diamonds. Y'all see him over there in that chair. Uh-uh. In my bed. Uh-uh. 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 Oh, there you go. Mr. Biggie is right here. Uh-uh. Mm -hmm. Good morning. Get up seven thirty. Yeah, that's the time. Let me buy yoga. No yoga today, though. Did yoga all day yesterday. Uh, uh, uh. I'm in my man's house. You know, right here. You know, I do a little bad. Mr. Beagle. Mr. Beagle. I'm sorry, I had to tell you how to report that Mr. Beagle ate about a whole pot of pinto beans last night, so you know he ain't going to get up this time. He parted hard last night. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Beagle. Yeah, I'm telling you, so we'll get like 20 some degrees. Beagles don't do never lay around. It's too damn cold for you. That's a hunting dog, right? That's a hunting big one. That's why he be kicking. He be wanting to hunt. You have to think about uh, rabbits. Oh, cute. Yeah, I'm tired of watching that. Oh, he's stretching, y'all. Boom. Come on. Oh. Well, anyway, I'm gonna get Mr. Big up. All I gotta do is cook. Look, get his ass up. Does he get to smell that good old ass? I'm sorry. <laughs> Streaming already, so. Guys, gonna get up in here and cook this food, y'all. Mm. Yeah, now Mr. Big laying right on the chair and stuff, y'all. So, I'm gonna cook this other breakfast. It's gonna be cheese, eggs, grits, and uh, cheese toast. And plus a cup, but a pot of coffee. Normally I would cook like some sausage and bacon or something like that, but since we had uh, um, pinto beans and ham hocks and cornbread and uh, that mix it over rice, no meat today. So with that being said, guys, um, I'm gonna get up in the next two minutes because my alarm said get up and go cook. And that's when I that's when I cook. And running don't tell me what to do in my live stream. He took a couple of alarm off without any cigar. Yeah, he's a nice uh, bow he is. So when he get down, I'm going to get cooking, y'all. Lord, I'm just thinking about how I'm going to do my hair today. I'm thinking about how I'm going to do my hair. I'm going to keep it up with bone too. It's cold. Cheers, guys. I've been live streaming all night, y'all. I'm tired, dog tired. But you know what? I do this because I love this, you know? I love cooking, I love being a homebody. And this is really the vlog one of, you know, the COVID-19 down in North Carolina where you gotta wear a mask and everything else. So I'm just giving you guys a, a, a proportion of what we do. We record, record production, you know, music to whatever on Carolina Diamonds and Dogs Are Us is its own self-entity. 
we are dogs are us. We tell you about dogs, all the dogs in our house. Uh, as you guys know, I had Jacob, Joshua, Jason. Uh, oh, she didn't get up, y'all, Mr. Beagle, because he knows what somebody's been to start cooking. When he see running move, he moves. He's a he, he, no, he really. You know, I didn't tell you. I don't know. Yeah, I want to see him straight. There you go. Yeah, I'm gonna watch a little bit of news. I probably cook about seven thirty. So it's on Mr. Beagle because you guys come to see him, not me. Take it out. Resources to be able to um, do medical oh, no, 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 no. 
Oh, Mr. B, you know, you got a cold. I'm gonna get you some goddamn NyQuil. Yeah, he got a cold, y'all. Yeah, he got a cold, so I gotta give him some uh, NyQuil. You give him a, a teaspoon of NyQuil in that water or rubber tussle. He'll be just fine. Um, that demonstrated um, a bit of decreased efficacy, as you noted, um, in the Nova Vax. I want some Donald Trump money. Donald Trump money. Money. Donald Trump money. Some of the dry shampoo today. Don't put it on your ass or your ass. Now, like, don't you? 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 Um, I'm going to go to the mall. Guess what? You want to give me some cookies and burgers? No, I didn't want to. You ain't got a cookie. And what's going on? Hello, how are you? Town treasure hunts and crime. What's going on, man? You're not making this on the AP 420 network. You're going one round. Metal detector. Yes. Thank you for subscribing. Hey, man, you got an awesome gun tent. Thank you for dropping by showing me some love, too. You know, I'll be having a wonderful one because I'm going to tell you right now, ain't no Kathy Laggy. It's 23 degrees. I'm going to bring some Donald Trump. I'm going down the risk of getting infection. Um, getting the vaccine, and the risk of not knowing that we believe that the state is vaccine on the state, but we don't have the data. So in my mind, so you going to lie today, um, town treasure hunter, because we are stuck here and going nowhere, and I don't think we're going to watch a video. Oh, my car is clunked. We are in the road. We're going to use our moderator and video coming. I hope you have a great day. If you're going to lie, I think you put it down in the chat so all my people come over and raise your challenge. CBP. Bam! Bam! Great challenge. So, yeah, I'll be able to check you out. But um, I have to get back and cook this break. Be right back. How to handle when many, many people, investors big and small, small, put billions of dollars into stocks. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Put it. And you know, if you guys, I got three people in the building, three thumbs up. And the patient, like, subscribe. I am Jason Little, aka Carolina Donna Productions, also uh, Productions Dogs are Us. So, you guys go ahead and leave comments. Like, tell you what you want to see. A lot of you guys like to get food. I'm just going to go around and look at the back. I'm going to be going out and get you out of the day. Oh, wow. I'm going to have my dog on Valentine's We got a big one right here. Wait! Think of Robin Hood's move. Uh, I thought it was pretty unfair and unjust. That prompted a major class action lawsuit against Robin Hood, <laughs> accusing the company of manipulating. Are you guys on double, double, double live stream? So, uh, uh, Carolina got me. Uh, 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 uh
Many public fouls have been jumped to work weighing in, tweeted, the Redditors aren't cheating. They're joining a party Wall Street insiders have been enjoying for years. All right, those are us. Y'all want dick? See, not that, not that, not that, not that. See that? And a good Come to Washington. Yes, here, you. All right, guys, let's get this breakfast started. The first thing we got to do is make some coffee here. All right, guys, the first thing we're going to do is make some coffee. Now, some of y'all might not have no filters. That's okay. I'm going to show what the trick that we learned in Army. 34 years, guys, 35, something like that. Just retired. So when I'm out in the field, I want to get me a cup of, cup of Joe. And I ain't got no filter. Guess what I do? Paper towels, your best friend, honey. That bouncy towels. It don't matter. So I'm going to do with this. First of all, I got to get the thing in going on. Hold up like that. Stick it in there. Double fold it and stick it in the uh, coffee uh, holder. <laughs> Any blend of coffee is fine. Each tablespoon of each coffee. Since this is a five tablespoon, uh, five cup holder, it's five tablespoons. Make sure it just so the coffee doesn't come out. Because if it does, you're going to have some nasty coffee, y'all. <laughs> fill up that, fill up your pot, coffee pot. <laughs> Probably not guys really to make sure now. If you like me put colorox in water, rinse it out and go see my colorox system gotta give me the diarrhea ta ta ta. <laughs> so put it up to five cups. Pour it in there. Pull it down. Look it up. Turn on. Yeah. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. Ooh. Ooh. And cheese and eggs, that's how we do it around here. And we get some grits going. Give me some toast and cheese on it, that's all. A little coffee. Whatever you want to throw your stuff. So, the first guy I got to do one thing with the stove back there. I'm playing my stuff last night. So, I got to put it back in there. I, I, I don't in my benzo. If you guys get a chance, can you check out Jesus the Freak? And it's the, it's called Jesus Freak, and the name of the video is uh, Cypress Hill. I, I, I don't in my benzo. He be rocking, y'all. Hey, he be rocking for the Canada. Anyway, we're getting back to the video. Friday party, y'all. Come on, come on, Carolina Diamond Productions. We about to get it on in here. Yes, yes, yes. Ready to burn, y'all. So, that being said, I need a pot with the grits. So, what we're going to do is we'll get you a pot. Not too much. We're going to cook for a big family. Probably need one of these. But since my family is a big, since I need a, my man and my dog. You'll need one, Mr. Grinch. All right. 
make a pot. I always wash my pots out, guys. Always wash pots out. I don't know. Is that COVID nineteen, man? Me, me and COVID nineteen ain't no damn best friends. So I have the low rise every damn down. That's just me. You know, I don't what you do, but me, I'm put down a low rise every damn but kill all of those terms, right? So I put my water in. I'm not gonna put that much in. There. That's just too much right there. Put about I don't know about two or three cups, two or three cups for your grits. Put it on the back. Some butter. She's got that heat up too high right now. But anyway, I ain't gonna say anything because my whole family cold. I'm just hot flashing. But anyway, menopause, ladies, you just gotta ignore it. It's a natural thing. You can't help that. Not me, but I understand, don't you know what? Do like I do. Cuss that motherfucking ass up. Get the hell on. <laughs> but anyway, about uh, two, tape, two tape, uh, tablespoons of butter, butter, milk. Better get good or not. Are you put them grits in there, y'all. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna get butter for the uh, cheese and eggs, so let's get that going. I tell you what, I'm gonna get going. I'm gonna get my toast going first. Even though I got a toaster. That pops up. I want cheese on my toast. I'm gonna put it in the stove old fast. Bubbling up, yeah. So I'm gonna cheese those on two or one. Once. You gonna back your car at 23 degrees down? Well, there's something wrong with you, boy. You want cheese on your toes or you want butter on your toes? All right, cheese. Cheese want cheese on your toes. I don't mind, sir. Roger that, sir. Roger that. And yes, we are a military family. We got a military dog, a military boyfriend. I am military. So if you don't know, well, I'm talking because I was a retired sergeant major. Well, I am a retired sergeant major. But it's all good. We have as many sergeant majors in the Army. But when you make E7 above, that means you're the top of the top of the cream, baby. Top of the cream. I'm an E9, the highest you can go. That's pretty good for a sister like me. <laughs> now, with that being said, guys, I'm going to cut me some cheese up, put it on this thing. I made a bread. I'm going to say thank you. <laughs> All right, guys, let's, let's speed this up a little bit. I'm going to cook breakfast. Normally, I'll be already and on and ate and had my coffee. And we slept in because we were pretty much working hard last night, live streaming, you know, having already fun like we always do around here in North Kakalaki. Hey, COVID-19, I just asked you guys to start doing YouTube channel. Shit. Oops. Let's network. Let's network. That's what we do. Let's go. Let's go. Let's grow. So I'm going to go ahead and turn my stove on. I'm going to turn uh, the grits up. I want to boil it, so I'm going to turn up on H. My stove, I'm going to turn on to about, about, no, 500. Depending on your stove, you know your adjustments to get yourself going. So, so Lord, I'm hungry. I'm so hungry, boy. I'm glad I didn't open cheese. I'm hungry, y'all. I got to eat. So I'm going to cut three, three Oh, Lord, I hate when you know, don't know what's going on. Y'all you know, give me a run. I'm, I'm going to take care of running. You're going to get the hell out of my kitchen. You know that? So three pieces of cheese. I'll eat a piece of bread. Okay. I'm going to show you guys just a minute. Just cut this cheese right quick. Okay. I am hungry. Ooh. Eat. Hungry, hungry, hungry. One more slice. Here we go. So, guys, this is what we got going on here. I'm just going to put that in the stove. Got two of them going on. I don't know if Mr. Beagle ate cheese or not, so I'm not going to make him any. He got his dog. I'm going to watch the damn meat. So, I'm going to keep that in there. Put the cheese in the bread. Cheese in the bread. Carolina done. 
Is it in there? And let it go. Oh, I got the wrong eye on, guys. Yeah. All right, let it go. Next thing now is the uh, grits. Good now, the cheese and the eggs. The most important thing for me, I love cheese and eggs, guys. Very easy, very easy. So what you're gonna do is get your little spatula, or whatever going on. Like so. Tablespoon of butter. Some milk, three eggs, a bowl. All right. And I like to whip my eggs, guys. And I'll be making a type of cake, guys. For you, uh, for you guys who want to know how to bake, I'll be making a homemade chocolate cake. So I'll upload that video because I started last night and I'm just going to finish my icing. But you guys should be coming from here sometime today. Not today, tomorrow. Because I do need to eat it. But getting back to this live stream cooking, you're going to need three eggs. Three medium size, well, three large eggs. One, two, three, I'll add a little bit of milk. And a little bit of milk in your eggs and a little bit of milk in your grits. What milk does is it enhances the oats and the uh, barley inside of the, and it gives your food a boom. You know what I'm saying? A, 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 a delicious, smooth flavor. And plus, it gets the lumps out your grits. Oh my God, I'm sorry. Now, with that being said, guys, I'm going to um, get me a little fork here and make sure that I get saturated. My, my, um, damn, I got the wrong eye on. Thanks. I actually do. So I'm going to go ahead and set I get wrong now. Well, that warm up, and then I'll just come over here and just beat my eggs. You want to beat it where the yolk is uh, very, is you, you pop your oak, scramble all around. <clears throat> and if you want to, you can go ahead and add your cheese inside here or there, it don't matter. Put it all to come together, guys. So now I can just put all my other ingredients up. That coffee just taking this sweet time. What's going just fine? Huh? Y'all, it's 24 degrees. Good God Almighty. Oh! All right, now. Something that I do, I don't know about you guys, but I like to put a little onions, onions in my eggs. Oh, yes. It wakes up the flavor, it enhances your cheese. So I put a little bit of onions. Give you antioxidants for your skin. It's been known to cure some strains of COVID-19. And it just tastes good to me. I love onions. I don't get too much of them because, you know, I don't like cutting so many onions, but just a little bit. You want to chop them up real fine. And we're going to put this inside of our eggs in the batter. All right. So my butter's going on pretty good, guys. And I'm chopping up my onions. Oh, yes. I'm very good at this. So take your time, guys. I want you guys to get your fingers up. I'm pretty good at it, though. So I took a course of culinary uh, art. And uh, being an army, because I was a quartermaster, so, you know, I know how to do a dining facility and all that. And I picked up a lot of shit in there. And when I switched over to supply sergeant, then I was like, oh, hell no, that's not going to give me the rank I need. Then I switched over to signal corps. So, with that being said, a little bit, and plus, you know, being North Carolina, you just know how to burn a pure point blank. A music experience to watch your grandma, and just, hey, you got to know how to cook. So, anyway, you just turn all that, just like that. And at the same time, what you're going to do is go cut three slices of cheese, two or three, depends on what you how, how you like it. Some people don't like cheese, but I did. 
You cut them up one, three, out of three big old slices. Because you want more cheese and more better. And since I'm on a diet, I ain't going to try to be a big old fat ass. So let me just put three, three over here. Put that back in the refrigerator. See? Now, guys, you want to stir it up? Stir it up like motherfucking coffee. <laughs> now, the little kids might be in here, so stir it up like coffee. And then what you're going to do next? So make sure you, excuse me, make sure your butter is definitely all over your pan. The one thing I hate doing is playing out. Pan with eggs in. So the more butter you put, the more your eggs come out. So I'm going to go ahead and turn out my um, grits up to a higher. I have eight or nine because I want to go and put my grits in it. So, okay. All right, by the time these eggs are shit together, you know, everything will come together. All right, so next thing you're going to do, go ahead and pour that batter in there. Like so. Now, please, on this time, what is happening? I do one or two things smoke a cigarette or clean up. So, guess what? I'm trying to quit smoking, I'm cleaning up. I love a clean kitchen, guys. Now, what I should have done in the South, what we do is use canned biscuits, you know, and basically. You take that, you can use molasses, jelly, put cheese in it, or make a sausage, cheese, egg, and biscuit. But but is that this is for Sunday, okay? Sunday coming at you. So now we just wait, 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 wait. Pour the grits. And they're but they're real hot. So hey, go ahead and put your salt. I put a little bit of onion salt in my um eggs. Right just a little bit. And guys, let me tell you one secret that my grandma always told me. Don't ever be afraid to season your food. And the reason why I like using acid is like a lower form of sodium. You know, use this right here. You won't be no high blood pressure. Bam! There you go. Accent. A little bit in there. Y'all know what I get that bam from? I've been watching too much AAP on Twitter. You got me hyped up, y'all. That's my boy from South Carolina. Right down the road. Okay. Got that going on. A little bit of pepper. And I don't put too much salt in my food. I let Ronnie put his own salt in his food because he likes salt. I don't. So uh, that's why I put so much salt in my food, guys. But anyway, put a little bit of black pepper in there. That's baby. Yep. 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 Now, why that uh, milk and uh, water and my black pepper and salt going on in there? Now I'm ready to put my, my grits in there. Any grits, any grits is fine. So today's purpose, I'm going to use some. Uh, I'm gonna make that, so I'm gonna have to do rice. Yeah, I'm gonna hate sitting and thinking I gotta do this one. Time to make a grocery run, y'all. Grocery run. Lord, I don't think we got no grits running. So, instead of you ain't got no grits, go ahead and use rice. Same thing, but I thought I bought some grits. I know I did. The devil is a lie. We always got grits at our house. This will be the first time in many years I don't. So I'm over here checking, checking. And guess what, guys? We don't have any grits. So guess what I'm gonna do? Rice it. Put rice in. Rice, 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 rice. So guess what? Change the plans. There's gonna be cheese, eggs, and rice. The rice is the same thing as grits, except for the white form, you know. I'm the damn rice. I'm just surprised by this. Here we go. <laughs> rice. Oh Lord, she overblowing Lord. I need to turn it down some. Go ahead and put my rice in there. All right, move you out. So with that being said, it's gonna take the rice about 20 minutes to cook. It'll take 20 minutes to cook. I'll turn up about five minutes. Take five minutes out by turning up on an extra notch. Um, so we'll go ahead. Put some other chunk of pork, stir everything up, stir it up. And me for my rice, I'm gonna put something over it because I don't want my rice to be falling over my eyes and shit. So, I'm not sure it's been done by now, but we're on the way because we don't have any grits. In the meantime, turn everything down and chill out, you know, everything but nice and low because we've got to wait on the rice, right? I like everything to be simultaneously come together, you know, that's when you know you're a good cook, when everything is done at the same time, you know? Oh, the cheese is looking good, the cheese is looking good. So what I'm gonna do right now is turn up my cheese and eggs. I just don't want to get the kids, but you know what I understand. 
Somebody else to get this thing to be in there. So, right now I'm turning everything down on low because we got to wait on that, on the rise. The collar ain't finished growing yet, so this is perfect. And ladies, and guys, you know, I mean, we don't got certain things. You got to learn how to adjust because COVID-19, a lot of things are closed. You might say like 2,000 miles from the store and you just hate going. But uh, when you don't have certain things like coffee filters, use paper towels. Um, then if you don't got any grits, use some rice. You know, if you're trying to be healthy, use brown rice instead of white rice. You know, so small, simple changes, you know, your diet or your, your, your regimen can make you more healthy. You know? That's how I look at it. You know, if you think somebody tell me something to better me, I'm going to use it. That's just me. So, for these things right here, too. Put them on medium. And you turn this eye off. I get my glasses on. And the next thing I'm going to do is just keep that rice on seven because I want to hurry up because I'm ready to eat, you know. And you know what I just thought about? I got fucking rice in the damn fridge right from last night. Who I just thought about it. Oh my God. Am I sleeping, y'all? No, I ain't sleeping here. I just cooked too damn much. I didn't like, have to cook this morning, but I decided to cook. Ronnie's home. You know, I'm not going to some leftovers from last night's dinner, you know? But, you know, when you got a man or whatever, you got to cook for him because, you know, the way to their heart is good cooking. Ain't that right, Mr. Mark? Yeah. 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 You guys are almost there. All right, I got time. We're going to sit down and talk to you guys for a minute. I'm going to come back and check on it. But just give you a brief synopsis. First, we're going to start with Dogs Are Us. Here. You see the cheese and eggs begin. And then, so let's check on this, uh, the toast. Carolina, I'm going to get you next. Look at it. Oh, yes, baby. We got to wait for it to get brown. Y'all see it? And the rice is just getting started, so I ain't going to go there. Put two uh, dollars else back over here because I'm cooking with both channels. All right, so now, oh, Carolina Diamonds Production. Let's see what's going on. Y'all already know I can burn over here. Look, bam, we get some cheese and eggs coming together. Look at that, that toast there. Oh my goodness, Lord, look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Nice. Oh, gotta wait on the rice. But in the meantime, guess what we're gonna do? Chillax. <laughs> That's what we do. So when this stuff comes together, guys, Rice should be about 15 minutes, so uh, I don't know if I can wait that long. That rice is not be something else. But we got we got rice in there, so I can go ahead and mimic that away with that rice to cook for dinner for later on. Because I am going to be cooking another dinner tonight. The load on my uh, Carolina Diamonds Diner. So this is the purpose of all this cooking, y'all. Videos, videos, videos. Y'all, you know, my family don't mind eating. I don't mind doing because that's the one thing I love doing is cooking for my family. Yes, 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 please believe me. Oh, let me turn y'all back on me. I'm sorry about the uh, Carolina Diamonds production. Oh, guys, thanks for the four thumbs up. Two people in the house. Yes. So you had to put that North Carolina Southern uh, breakfast here. Bam, can I get a thumbs up? Like, subscribe, want to see more cooking. Can I get a one in the chat, please? Well, I guess you want to guys want to see how it tastes. Anyway. Oh, I need to lose some weight, baby. Y'all see all that junk in the dust getting twerking, y'all. Oh, yeah, I'm going to get it in. Y'all, you know, sad news. I hate to report that uh, Miss Sweet Cicely Tyson died at 96 years old. Also, I used to watch this show called Mary Tyler Moore. A uh, sweet little young lady, I can't remember her name. Um, well, she, meant, she looked like Samantha. She played on Bewitched to Me, but she died at 92 years old. She used to be on, had her own show for a very long time. My mom and I used to watch it. And uh, I think, and then she was on, um, what's that show? Uh, when they danced all, all the time. Well, that's what she did. And she just passed away. And those, those ladies right there, to be in Hollywood, they look so good. They was inspiration to a lot of us, like people that was born in the 70s like me. They used to watch over us while mom and daddy were going to work, you know? And Roots, oh my God, who could ever forget Roots and this Jane Pittman? You know, when I heard about them dying, I just cried. And that's what I did. And my eyes were swollen with crying, guys. That, that really hurt me, man. Robin Williams, when he died, it hurt me. Fred Sample died, it hurt me. I mean, if they were part of my 
childhood when people die, I, I cry. I don't care if you start not. Michael Jackson, Lord of the World, cried. Prince cried. Yeah, Kirk Cobain cried. Oh God, this is crazy. At least I can say one thing about Cicely Tyson, the Honorable Cicely Tyson, and the legendary that was that young beautiful lady named the player Mary Tyler Moore. They were very, very. It was very instrumental. My my growth. It became my mom. My mom TVs, you know, my TV. I mean, my mother on TV when my mother was working three or four jobs. I knew she to make sure that we had everything so we'd be on welfare. So my mother's a military woman. My dad is too. So that's why I say the things I do. Time to get this stuff up out of here, y'all. Get this good breakfast going because I am done. I'm going to play for me. I'm not going to eat this one because I'm full from last night, guys. I might eat later on. And we're going to go with something like this. So, I'm going to come out here. Get one of some things, but some things. All right. Um, be very careful when getting these two cheese toast out so that you burn the shit out tonight. I need a spatula. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Oh, yeah. Oh, that looks so good, y'all. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. And uh, turn the stove off. Okay. Next thing we're going to do is um, get these things on the plate. Yeah, boy. Oh, man. I'm not hungry, guys. This is all for running. Again, so today, highs will be getting into the upper 40s. Cool, sunny, that's late breeze out of the north. Tonight, another freezing one for us here. Because clear skies, temperatures dropping into the mid 20s. We're not any more. Let me tell you about the rice. We'll let the rice just cook for another minute. Turn everything off except the rice. Oh, yeah. And let me tell you what we'll do about the rice. I cooked rice last night, guys. So this is what I'm going to do since I ain't got any food. Put some on a plate and uh, put it in the microwave about. See, guys, I cooked rice last night, so I'm going to put this in a bowl and let it go. That rice right there will be used for dinner tonight. Well, it's not wanting that, right? Let's go to the grocery store. I just want to, where do I want to go to the grocery store with COVID 19? Not me. Not the states of me. So, take that and put it in the uh, microwave about two or three minutes. Uh oh, in my band now. I'll take the rice, put it in my quick about. In a minute, I'm going to show y'all some real fun. <laughs> I'm going to show y'all some real fun. Y'all want to see what this nigga doing, dogs or us? Oh, that rice is going. <laughs> what did? This is what your dog is doing, y'all. Uh-uh-uh. Hey, he said, y'all, it's 23 degrees. Leave the hell alone. <laughs> so, y'all back to Mr. Beagle back over here. Y'all got a dog for us. You got your, your star back. He's chilling. He'll be going all day. You'll be all with him all day because he got to have so many videos. So, I'm trying to make 10 videos out of one. Wait a minute. Now come back to you guys, Carolina. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes. Not quite. No, Y'all know me. I got some kids. She's a mother of four kids. Grandmother of five. Yes, yes, yes. 
see someone that works hard hours trying to make a living for her family and her life was so yeah. snuffed out. Detectives watch the store surveillance video. Tells together what happened. Two subjects in the store very rapidly. You see a reaction from the one of the robbery suspects, and then they quickly right, only guys. Guys. You really can't get this bowl up. I have that old fashioned bowl where it is. Yeah, I was right there staring me in the face. There ain't no words to explain how to feel when you know you're responsible for something. You know what I'm saying? It's like. You now we go. One, two, three. And then get somebody else to screenshot. It's a wake up call. Now, this for the Your actions cost somebody else's life. You know, and it was for what? You know, for some cigarettes? Yeah. For some money? Yeah. Now you're in this little way. No. Now, when my food is good, they're going to tell me two things. I don't want the damn shit or it's good. It's good. It's good. Got it? Like that Super Bowl kick. It's good. <laughs> oh, God. I like having fun this morning, guys. Now, you don't believe what I'm telling you. I'm going to tell you. Check him out, check him out, check him out. Is it good running? Yes. What is here? Mr. Big Gap. Yeah. 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 Carolina Diamond, Big Dogs are Us. We have to put a picture. I got on. I'm going to put you guys back up in here. I'm down. I'm going to put you guys back up now, if you like that video, give it a thumbs up. Please. Yes, 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 yes. Hi, yes. guys. Let's look at the top. I know right now. Yeah, I'm going to look at the top. Sound effects. Yes, sound effects. Sound effects. Sound effects. Get myself together. It's been 
In the video, one of the suspects brings a purse during the course of our interview. Uh, we got to show you guys the final product. Yes, yes. And let me show you what Mr. Beagle We got to shut down this production. Mr. Beagle, Mr. Beagle, are we going live right now? Not right now, later. Well, tell your people goodbye, Mr. Beagle. Say holla, holla. Yeah, okay. All right, guys. Peace. Screenshot. No, it wasn't. That's the cover pot.